Concerns tonight near downtown Commons or DOCO. Sacramento police say there's been an uptick in crime in the K Street corridor over the last year. And with big crowds out tonight for the King's Home Opener, CBS 13's Sharon Merger got answers about how police are trying to curb the problem. Tony and Adrian, the hype and the energy was electrifying here in downtown. Huge crowds came out for the opening game, and the businesses were cashing in on all the foot traffic. But just feet away from Doko is the K Street corridor, where there are some real concerns tonight. Police tell me that crime reports and violent activity is up. Walking to the beat of the drum, thousands of Kings fans donning their purple jerseys poured into the Golden One Center ready for opening night. New arena smell still has not worn off. Uh, it's still very exciting for about 18,000 people. New businesses like Display California beautifying their shelves. There's a lot of traffic, a lot of buzz. A few doors down, Fizz, the new champagne and bubbles bar, getting that bubbly ready. This is the space to be. This is where the excitement is. But while the bright lights of the arena and DOCO have brought new life to downtown SAC. We're noticing on K Street an increase in crime. And so we have a 23% increase year to date. Just feet away, the K Street corridor is struggling with some real safety concerns. Businesses are indicating to us that their customers are scared. And they're scared because of the erratic behavior by some people that are on K. Erratic behavior based on drug use or mental health. Sacramento police report an uptick in disturbances, assaults, and drug activity, primarily in the 9th and 10th. Blocks of K, causing some businesses like Sharif Jewelers to lose customers. Some of them that have mental health issues, drug issues, that really, I mean, calling to have them arrested and put them back on the street within a few hours is not helping our situation. What is the police department doing to kind of mitigate this issue or make people feel more safe, make businesses feel more safe? Well, we're increasing our police um, presence on K. We're also um, bringing our impact team and our mental health team out here to try to help those that are willing to go to services. And while police do their work, many are not too concerned. This is far from a crime-ridden area. This is an area that's going through growing pains and, and will absolutely figure itself out. And police tell me they're monitoring the safety concerns closely and working with businesses to come up with solutions to make sure everyone's safe.